And around the turn, they go. The Trotters have reached the back stretch, and they are underway. And Sierra Girl looked like she took a little bit of a bad step there. She's on stride, but she is well back from the rest right before the start. She started slow, and so Paulina Hanover takes the early lead. She's chased into second by Shishak down at the pylons. Is, uh, my, is a Little Town Road in third. And behind her, that's... Uh, Love you bunch of slip sliding away, trying to brush on the outside to get close. Then Landa Lucy Sierra Girl settles seventh with a moment as the trailer. Quarter of 27 and one fifth. Pretty quick here. It's Andrew McCarthy. Paulina Hanover is the aggressor, but now slip sliding away. Takes over the lead there for Dexter Dunn. So Paulina Hanover back in the pocket, followed by Shishak in third. Single file, it goes to Little Town Road. Then it's two back to fifth and love you bunches. Landa Lucy sixth, Sierra Girl. The favorite dug herself a hole, and she is seventh, moving to the outside, and the trailer is the moment. So slip sliding away, leads it now by a length and a half, gets to the half mile marker, 56 and 4, 29 and 3 for the second panel. They're on the back stretch now. There's Dexter Dunn leaning back here with slip sliding away. Paulina Hanover hoping to make another move at her. In third is Shishak, and there's Sierra Girl trying to make up that ground with the first over. She's picking off horses. She's within three. The moment follows up that move. Back on the inside, sixth is Little Town Road. Then comes Land Lucy in the trailer. Love you bunches. The lead down to a long neck for slip sliding away. Three quarters, 125 and four. 29 even third panel as Sierra Girl against the odds has get has uh, reached back into it here slip sliding away still holding her ground in the pocket Paulina Hanover late moves by the moment at the little town road top of the stretch slip sliding away put to the test by Sierra girl and now the moment's coming up three wide inside Paulina Hanover not there it's Sierra girl and slip sliding away Sierra girl can she do it she did I believe Sierra girl who dug the early hole I think she just nosed out her stable mate slip sliding away. Then it's going to be the moment uh, with a photo with Polly and Hanover for third. This will be a photo for the win as well. And I'm sure the judges will take a look at the star to make sure she conformed to any breaking rules. If she did even go off stride, I didn't even see it. She just was a little bit back from the gate. But she manages to overcome that and get there for what looks like a win in 155 and 4. Well, the only horse to have beaten Sierra Girl so far was slip sliding away, and certainly Sierra Girl spotted her enough of a margin by starting slow behind the gate. But look at Oka Svonstead. Not only does she start slow, then she has to grind her way first over, and you can see that she just noses out slip sliding away in just a ridiculous effort. Parked all the way, slow starting, and wins a $252,000 race. Not a non-winners of one that she overcome became a slow start start here just huge judges have posted the unofficial order of finish race number nine number five sierra girl finished first number seven slip sliding away finished second number six the moment finished third number eight paulina hanover finished fourth unofficially five seven six eight in race number nine Heading back towards the Hanover Shoe Farms winner's circle is the unofficial winner of tonight, today's ninth race. And this is the Pennsylvania Sire Stakes Championship for two-year-old trotting fillies, number five, Sierra Girl. She is a two-year-old bay filly by bar hopping out of Chucky's Lucky Charm by Lucky Chucky, bred by Sam Stoltz Jr. of Pennsylvania, owned by Oka Svonstead Incorporated, Wrightstown, New Jersey, Young Guns, New York, New York, Joe Sprocko and JAF Racing of Staten Island, New York. Oka Svonstead, trainer and driver. Boy, Oka's been so great here in stakes races. Of course, in Sun Stakes Saturday, he uh, ripped off three big wins, uh, all the, the, of the uh, six big races. And now here with Sierra Girl gets the first sire stakes of the day. Sierra Girl, the one to five betting favorite, wins for the fourth time in five career starts. She won all three of her sire stakes preliminary legs as well as the final.
The win today gives her now four wins in five lifetime. Going to put her career earnings, uh, take a big jump here. Let's see if we do the math. Over $211,000. She wins today 155 and four. Judges have just sent me in the rundown, so this is official. She did conform uh, to uh, any kind of breaking rules. Again, I don't even know if she broke stride before. Uh, she was already on stride once the race started. And uh, congratulations, two-year-old trotting Philly, Pennsylvania champion for 2023 is number five. Sierra girl. Judges have posted the unofficial order of finish for race nine as Sierra girl gets her uh, plaque there. Uh, number one, Love You Bunches finished seventh. Two Little Town Road was sixth. Three, She Shack finished fifth. Number four, Landa Lucy was eighth. Number five, Sierra girl, the race winner. Sixth, The Moment finished third. Number seven, Slip Sliding Away was second and eighth. Paulina Hanover finished fourth. Top down seven, six, five, eight, one, three, two, four. Race winner five, Sierra girl, 155. And four fifths. Race 10 is coming up next. That'll be the Pennsylvania Sire Stakes Championship for two year old pacing. Phillies purse $252,000. Zach Trice.